on this, Danielle. Mark, this investigation started back in 2011, and as you mentioned, uh, Sheriff Joe Arpaio now taking questions after this press conference. Now, he was here today joined by the lead investigator in this case, Mike Zullo. Uh, this press conference here wrapped up about 45 minutes ago. Now, the two laid out a PowerPoint presentation. They say the evidence proves the birth certificate was forged and that there's nine points of forgery. The two showed the birth certificate provided by the White House side by side with the certificate of a woman by the name of Johanna Ani. They were printed 16 days apart. They say dates, words, and letters were taken from Ani's certificate and copy-pasted on Obama's certificate. Zulu also laid out birth certificate laws in Arizona. Well, when you start to study the Hawaii statutes, you realize there are ways to amend a certificate that turns the real certificate into a sequestered record in another file and the amended information now becomes the original birth document and that could happen 54 6400 years later said Arizona before going into that bind. The, those were uh, the laws around birth certificates in Hawaii, so uh, excuse me for that. Now, Zulu says that he wanted to be the clearinghouse in this case. He says that uh, he wanted to clear these rumors of the birth, birth certificate being false, but unfortunately, he says that the evidence in this case did not um, allow him to do so. So at this time, he's saying they are just not sure where Obama was, in fact, born, but that was never their intention. Their intention was to only uh, certify this birth certificate or say that it is forged in this case. Now, he's telling us today that he's going to be taking all of this information to Congress. Reporting live, Danielle Miller, Fox 10 News. Okay, Danielle, at one point, more than 30,000 people were watching this news conference, streaming live on our Facebook page, and it has a lot of people talking tonight, as you might imagine. Cindy writes, it's called fraud, people, and it's an important issue. It's the law, though some liberals would much rather you not recognize that. And Jerry here, he says, Obama is a criminal, period. All you people out there who voted for him are lazy, both literally and intellectually. Enjoy your tour, sheep. Adults are about to be back in charge. Get ready. And this person writes, Obama is a great president. He's done all he could to help those who actually need help. Those against him will never give him credit for anything. The live stream reached millions of people on social media. If you'd like to watch the entire news conference for yourself and send us your feedback, go to facebook.com slash Fox 10 Phoenix. New at six, one of three people.